What's going on, everybody? My name's Chris, and welcome back to another exciting episode of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker HD Ply. Last episode, we continue to make our way through the freaking dungeon of the Tower of the Gods. <laughs> the Dungeon of the Gods. The Sex Gods, that is. It's a sex dungeon. <laughs> Apologize. Um, oh, this ladder is weird. It's like, oh, look at it. It's all slanted and stuff. Maybe that's just some kind of weird illusion. So, yeah, this is a scale. And I kind of showcased that in the last episode, and I don't feel like you jumping back down there. So, you're just going to have to believe me. That's freaking scale, okay? <laughs> so, what we're going to want to do here is I'm going to throw one of these dudes on one of the sides here. Like, perfect. Awesome. Time to go. Aw, oh, crap. <laughs> so yeah, Link weighs the equivalent of one statue. So, what we're going to want to do here is throw two statues. Eh. Yay, and there we go. That should be enough weight to distribute Link's weight uh, perfectly. And I forgot that this door needed a key to go through it, so I'm kind of happy we had a key, actually. Key, actually! Ski be dee be dee. Did we get a key? I guess we got a key in one of the lower rooms there. Oh boy, this room. Oh jeez. This room gave me a hell as a kid. Um, I had no idea what to do. I remember using the Tingle Tuner to like give me abilities to like float and all that, and I had no idea how to get past here. Like, there's no way. Like, how in the world are you supposed to get past this room? Well, you use your deck relief. And it's weird because it, you don't like you really underestimate, or yeah, you really underestimate how amazing your deck relief really is. Because it's like you think. When you glide with anything, it's like you're going down at a like gradual angle, but with the Deku Leaf, while that is true, it's not as like powerful as you would expect it to be. Ah, oh, dude. There we go, I released the stick too early. One thing that's actually new in this game, but I didn't even realize it was a thing, it, yeah, this guy could just walk through the late. Oh, I was gonna say, I can walk through the late, this is right. It doesn't look like you want to do it. Yay! Oh, now we're gonna go back. I could go for this one. Uh, I don't know if you guys noticed there, but whenever I I did the song, it didn't go over the song again. Like when you play a song, it goes do 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 do, and then I do the song again and go do do do. Oh my god! I was gonna say I didn't miss that, did I? And look, look, it's a whiz robe. Uh oh. Oh. I guess how you're actually supposed to deal with this guy is using bone arrow, but you know, screw that. Uh, wow, he's taking a lot of hits. Bam! Oh, this screams really. <gasps> Nothing, hey. All right, so now with your statue combined, you're gonna want to throw one, two, and three of these statues because for some reason Link weighs the exact equivalent to these statues. I don't know how the Tower of the Gods like figured that out and made these statues weigh exactly how much Link did but yeah you want to throw two I was like oh perfect I could jump up there now and grab that statue nope don't do that don't do that kids because then it'll just sink down because it has the weight of the statue so yeah that statue weighs the equivalent of the statues down there plus the weight of Link I was gonna say why the heck that happened that is not how those scales should work at all I guess the time it takes you to lift it up you lose some weight or something <laughs> and then you gain it again because Link gulped in air and that weighed him down that's not how weight works okay so we actually missed another treasure chest earlier in the dungeon here since we didn't have the bone arrow yet so we have to go back for it i believe it's in one of these side rooms though so it should be pretty easy to get yeah so that's all rooms completed and now they make green glowies oh so cool i love the way they transition from the blue to green glow yay that thing looks like it'll heal me I wish it would, but it totally won't. Alrighty, uh, is it this way? No, it's the other way. The otter way. That's the way of the otters, man. The way of the otters. <laughs> I have no idea what that means. Alright. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, it's weird. Wizard just kind of appear. Eh. Oh no! Holy crap! Ah! Oh, oh, man. Oh, that scared me <laughs> a lot, if you couldn't tell. Don't know why I bothered killing that Chew. I should have realized he would die. Oh boy. Eh. Alright, let's see where this takes me. Please don't go into the wall thus killing me. Please go up. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Ow! Ow! <laughs> Alrighty, let's go through the door. Uh, another one of these rooms, eh? Man, they introduced a lot of new enemies in this part of the temple, or this part of the game. 
Whoa, 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 get off, get off, get off. <gasps> Holy crap. Oh, no. Holy jeez. All right, just run away from them. Uh, we should probably drink grandma soup. All right, we'll, we'll just play carefully here. Oh, good lord. Yeah, I'm a bit um <laughs> jumbled up here. I, wonder, I don't know what's in that. Is there just going to be another joy pendant? Might be just be another joy pendant. Or some stupid. I mean, it's in one of those chests. And normally in those chests are just like enemy spoils or keys or rupees. I used to have those rupees. At least we could carry those now. I'm going to upgrade. Are you kidding me? You got joy pendant. Yeah, there's so many of these. They're, so all, they're just all trolls, man. They're so easy to get. Which, I mean, brings up a point that I've been wanting to talk to for the past 20 episodes. <laughs> my, um... My Whoa, I almost jumped down there. That would have been horrible. Uh, I want to talk about my scales. No, my, my sidebar things. You know, the, the loot and, and all the other... You know what? You know what? We're just going to prepare this. I'm not going to drink it. I should have freaking drank it. Damn it. Stupid jumping. God dang it. Ah. Anyways, all the sidebars I've been doing. You know, I may be wondering why some stuff is missing, such as like, how come I don't have chew jelly on the spoil side? Now that's because we don't need a specific amount in order to complete the game. Oh, that's so annoying. At least we're actually pretty close to where we need to go anyway, so it's not really too big of a deal. But still, that's a pain in the pee pee. <laughs> it's actually crazy. I only have five hearts at this point in the game. I think I normally would have more. But nope, not this time apparently. But yeah, and like even like the 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 down sidebar or bottom bar or whatever I guess you would call it, like that doesn't have very much. Like it doesn't have nearly as much as I wanted to, and I wanted to do specific like. Uh, stuff like I did in Ocarina of Time where every dungeon I went to would have its own specific sidebar to, for all the items Like even the item of the dungeon and all that But the reason why I'm not doing that this time around is mostly due because this is a HD game So I can't really do that because I mean it kind of loses its 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 spark when you can't see the sidebars all the time Because I mean if I were to do that And, and by the way, this, this is what this central thing does. It, it's, a, it's an elevator that goes up if I were to have like sidebars on all the time, showing like all the items I've got in the dungeon and all that, I mean, what would be the point? Like it would cover up most of the screen, and the only way you guys would ever see it is when I got an item. So it's at that point, it's like you're probably gonna know what I already what I already have. Ah oh, man, those are so hard to hit. Oh, you know what though? In this game you could strafe. Yeah. Holy crap, that is really hard. Uh, actually, it makes it kind of easy when in this game when you can strafe. Yay, another joy pendant. What joy? Uh, actually, I don't even know if there's a point to killing these guys. I'm going to do it, but... This actually makes this killing these guys a lot easier. Hmm. Oh, it is kind of hard with this controller. Uh, I almost feel like that did not hit, but okay, I'll take it. <laughs> there's nothing in any of these? No, there's not. There probably would have been hard stuff if it wasn't hero mode. Oh boy. Alright, let's take this guy. Put him over here. Take that guy and put him over there. I'll take that guy and put him over there. We already did this puzzle. Come on, Nintendo. Step up your game, man. We've already done this puzzle. We did this with the elevator. The elevator. Yeah, it probably didn't have to kill those Beemos. But I did it. And the Beemos. Actually, I don't think I've been. Oh, hello. I did not expect that. The Beemos, if you didn't already know. Uh, the, those those weird tower things that they only show up when you get close enough and they shoot lasers. You got the big keys, the gangents, the room of the boss looks. Oh. These guys make a weird gulping noise. It's really weird, but you know. Yeah, so we got him in the eye. I believe you can only hit him in the eye with the arrow. Alright, I gotta I gotta switch up this. No, let's do that right now. I don't like how this is set up. Let's do a hold. No, hold! There we go. Uh, it makes it too hard. There we go. I like that a bunch more. A lot of times in this game, I notice when you'll like you'll put a target on someone, and if it's on switch mode, you'll go to hit it, switch, and then you won't want to switch. You just want to get off the enemy so you can like run away and back off. But nope, game does not like you doing that for whatever reason. Right. How many? No, I would just. What? How do I, How do I see what's in here? Uh, gotta... Stop it! No! Stop! That's how I see what's in here. Jeez. 
have 11. I need 20. I'm, I'm looking at the feathers, by the way. Oh, no, I should probably. Let's take that. Ooh, we're right at the boss, actually. Have we gotten everything in this dungeon? Let's take a look. Take a look-see. It looks like... Nice. So, you have 100% in this dungeon, then. Awesome. <gasps> no! I don't want to drink that yet. I got mixed up. I went to pull out my arrows. Dang it. Be careful. I just got to be very careful. I'm going to totally take down it right here, aren't I? All right. <laughs> so I don't even know if I've... Yeah, actually, we've seen these. We've gotten the feathers from the birds before. Okay. So, thankfully, with these guys, is they can only shoot in one direction for some reason. Holy crap. Is it ever bright up here? How far down can we see? Not very. Well, I guess we can kind of see far down. Once again, easy peasy lemon of the squeezes. These ones look so weird in this game. I don't know, they're just... Oh, good lord! Dang it! I didn't realize that one was spinning. At the speed of... Are you serious? Good lord! Hey, you want to aim freaking super high up, apparently. Ha! <laughs> Down a heart. That sucks. That really bites. That's gonna probably bite me in my butthole. <laughs> Whoa. Okay, I thought that was moving. Oh, good lord. He sees me. All right. Let him attack. Actually, let's do this first. Attack me, you butt. What? What is the point? What is the point of the shield if it doesn't defend you? Are you serious? Are you kidding me right now, game? Wow. I am not happy. I was like, oh, great. I'll use my freaking shield and let it defend me like it's supposed to do. Seriously, Link? Seriously? Oh, no. I did not know. Are you kidding me? I did not even see that guy. Wow. Just wow. Wow. Screw you. I'm nice and high for you. Oh, good lord. I'm not aiming very high. <gasps> Damn it. Ooh, hello. Thank you. <laughs> well, I got angry over nothing. That didn't the house. So Whoa, that is that is glitchily shiny. Did you guys see that? Can we do that again? Alrighty then. Great. Oh, yes. Okay. To be fair, I didn't know about this fairy in here. I did not know about the other one. That was in. I thought there was one. Is there, unless there's like another one in here, which is entirely possible as well. There's not. Okay. So yeah, I thought there was one fairy here. I'm like, I did not know there was a fairy in this guy. Ah, whatever. Stupid. <laughs> All right. Let's put on our deck relief. Uh, we just need our bow and arrow for this boss fight. Let's go. Screw it. I'm not doing a 12 minute episode, a 13 minute episode, I guess. Here comes a really cool boss, Lorena. Maybe. You have done well to find your way to this place. Oh, chosen one. I'm a chosen one? Accept this final challenge. Ah, oh, so cool. Ah! Two hands. Uh-oh. And a head. <laughs> Oh, it looks so awesome! Okay, so I actually made a blunder here. We're also gonna need the bombs in this boss fight, so let's take that out quickly. So, let's just like any Zelda game with eyeballs. Shoot him with the arrows! Oh, you gotta hit more than once. Okay, it's so, like, do I just gotta hit these? Oh, uh, no. What? I don't. What? Alright. So, to be fair, why am I not hitting? What? What the heck? Oh, good lord! And then you use a freaking explosion. Oh, that was not very many, though. I was, why was I not hitting first? <laughs> first of all, why was I not hit? Oh no, oh, no, no, no. We're already down half our arrows. That is kind of poopy. And, uh. Hit his eyeball. Hit his eyeball. There we go. Alright, so once he falls, he'll open his mouth, and as a kid, I have no idea what to do here. There we go. Much like the Beemos guys. By the way, don't fall in there, it'll electrocute you. Yeah, hey, whenever you hit him. I love the music to it. It reminds me of like a hockey game kind of music. Do, 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 do. I, I don't know why. It's weird. It's very weird actually. But, oh man. Alright, four shots will do this here. Oh, not when that happens. 
What? I don't even... It's like, what is going on here? I can't miss another shot. Wow. Great. Oh, yeah. There we go. I'm actually kind of happy about to show that. No. Jump up there, please. Serious. Game. Game. Oh, great! For fuck's sakes! <laughs> I'm sorry! I'm sorry! Alright, he's now... Yeah, when you run out of arrows, he'll sneeze them out, which is kind of a bit of a cop-out. Oh, great. It only gives you 10. That's really bad. Uh-oh. I forgot about this part. Oh, Jesus. Jesus! Oh, he only has one! Run, 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 run! Alright, yeah, that's actually pretty freaking awesome to avoid, not even gonna walk. I can't be mad at that. Yes! Alright. Now. I'll run away before the bomb kills me. <laughs> I love how, the, how it smokes through his ears and through his nose. Not through his mouth, though. Alright, we're gonna hit both twice. How come he stopped? Huh? What? Did I, did I hit that hand? Did I knock that hand out? I did not. That's actually kind of good. What? How many times do I have to hit you, hands? Again? No. Oh, I heard that. I thought maybe that. Holy crap, how quick are these hands gonna come back to life? Is the other one back to life now? Yeah. Again? Yeah, that's one down. Uh oh. Whoa! Ah! Oh, thank God I have the fairy. Thank God that I found that mystery fairy I didn't know existed the first time. All right, careful. I should be able to do this. I believe once I get this eye, I throw the bomb in there successfully, 100%. Oh man! I'm pretty sure when he shoots your yeah, when he shoot when he shoots your arrows, that means you have to restart the phase. Oh, do you not? His eyes still open. Oh, no, he's about to. Oh, I thought he was about to shoot his nose lasers at me. Oh, now he is! Now he is! Ah, I love how the room lights up when he's about to do that, too. Really freaking cool. There we go. Right? Yeah! Yes! I think that's it! I think that'll do her! Yeah! We did it, guys! Woohoo! The Pop Konami Open. This right here, this shot right here, reminds me of um, Pitfall Lost Expedition. Oh, Chosen One. It reminds, it's just the El Dorado stuff. What will come now to pass is tied to your fate, to the path that you have chosen. Go forward with caution. Holy crap, blah, 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 blah. I'm always scared that when I kill a boss, I'll be standing right where it teleports you, and then it'll just put me there after the cutscene's over. <laughs> uh, did I always get a heart piece on you? Look, you! <laughs> I love it so much. Oh, another terrifying thing is getting this heart piece. Cause like, oh, I don't want to accidentally step in the portal. Oh. There we go, guys. You got a heart container. Your life energy is increased by one. Plus, your life gauge has been replenished. I love this boss room so very much. Ah, oh, it looks so cool. Well, unfortunately, we didn't fight the boss on the top of the tower like I thought it would be. But that was still a pretty badass. Although, I, it would have been pretty fun to fight him on the very top of the tower as well. A little bit disappointed. Quite frankly, I'm very disappointed in Nintendo. How dare you guys? I am disgusted. And kind of a weird how it just teleports me up here. Alright. A bit of an odd sequence. It's like, this didn't teleport me down to the boat. Huh. Just in this, like, little area where you can't do very much. However, if we look up, there's a grappling point. Ho, ho, ho. Ho, 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 ho. And I can't reach it, because I'm standing in a bad spot. <laughs> Ooh, alright guys. I think I figured out what to do here. In the next episode, we'll ring the bell. And we'll see something freaking awesome. So until next time, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye bye